I lie a bit. I've come over from Brooklyn already, but um, Central Park is a good place because there's very few cars. Lots of joggers, though. You have to watch out. And uh, on a beautiful day like today, you just can't think of anything better. Free. You can do whatever you want, any time, any place, stop, start. Uh, it really is amazing like that. And it's good for you. You get all fit and healthy. And you see the city, or well, cities like this, uh, from a very kind of intimate perspective. The other thing I love about cycling is that people respond to you all the time. You know, people come up to me, well, as they pass me, they say, cool hat, man, those boots are rad. Hey, nice sunglasses. You know, so you kind of meet, meet people and make friends. Right there, that's uh, the owner, Miguel. Hi, Miguel. The, 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 the best cyclist in New York. Yeah. Worldwide masseuse. Worldwide did the... Uh, uh, Turo Santo Domingo, Vuelta of Tachira, A1 Mechanic. Doing a fabulous job on my bike. Fabulous job, he's, he's trying to. Uh, and you can see all our selection of bikes right here. We got a whole bunch of here and here. See all the bikes here? The park is one block away. That's it, looking good, that's it. <laughs> so, I've come in here to replace my basket. Okay. So, with a strawberry basket on the bottom of it to keep it off the wheel. So now we have this fabulous new basket at the front. Hello. I want you, I want you oh. to see the custom work of the, the light. Custom work of the light. Because the keys, the keys, the keys, what I told them, when you put your pocketbook, if you put it like here, you're not going to see. That's right. And then we did some adjustment. We are known by doing like custom work here. Very good attention to detail. Thank you very much, guys. That's the main man. Okay, well now I'll get back on the road and I've got my cycling map too. Now, for you, you have to have to riding for a couple of hours now um, across from Brooklyn and I'm way up near getting towards 90th Street and I'm going to cut across from the east to the west and I suddenly had this revelation about that t-shirt that everyone wears everywhere else but here that I heart New York thing I suddenly got it just riding around on the bike and seeing 
this incredible vista everywhere. You know, the river, the incredible architecture, the apartment blocks, people out in the park having a gorgeous time. I suddenly got it up. My heart throbbed for New York City. <sighs> and on we go. Looks a little bit like Sydney. <laughs> on a good day, look at all these gorgeous bridges. And look at all these people just stoked out of their heads that it's sunny, finally. Here's another fellow cyclist. I think she hearts New York too. This is a Schwinn. Uh, the Schwinn has no gears. Um, oh, I'm sorry. It's got a stand though, which is very handy. Let me just show you. And um, it's got a new basket. Oh, you want to have a look at my shoes? Because, um, you know, some people have special riding shoes too, but I just um, wear the basic cowboy boot model. Yeah, there's the Schwinn with my um, boots and chattel in the basket and the lock. I'll show you the lock. You need a good lock, even though it's, you know, your basic model, you don't want to lose it. And you need a bell. Because if you don't have that, you're going to crash into some peds. And some flashing nights for when you come home from nightclubs at about 3 a.m. in the morning across Brooklyn Bridge. And when you do that, you've got the bridge and the city all to yourself. Through 